Good morning, this is Veldragos, and I'm back on the Chili server. Today on the Sprout Pack, we're going to be working on a new area. I decided to attempt the Ars Magica mod, and I because I figured this is the best spot for it. Best thing to place into this area. Whoop, let's get my view around. I'm going to place it this little triangular area. It can't really put a building here because it would be in the way. The weird shape prevents a square building and a diagonal buildings are n never fun to do with windows and stuff. So I'm going to be placing the 5x5 five five altar structure right around here. There's going to be a little um, monolith or on each of the three sides and the work area is going to be next to the path here. I haven't done anything with the Ars Magica mod before so we'll be learning this together. I, I went into my system and pulled out a little bit of everything that it looks like I needed but the first thing that we need is the book. To get make the book you need an item frame and a normal book I don't want, know what the six is doing here. But you need to find a pool. I took and found one. Oops, wrong one. And made a home set so we can get back here quickly. And to make your book, I actually have three of them that I already found out of. Um, the book bags, but you need a frame and you put book down and it draws the essence from the um, Pool there are these pools you'll see everywhere and it imbues the book and turns it into one that we need This is the arcane compendium And if you open it up it tells you for your first spell, you gotta make an Oculus. Well, let's take this and we'll head back home. We had a bit of problem. I've been able to record for a few days because for some reason, the, my quantum mine that I have down here in the basement was it triggering it's a weird place for a goat or a sheep was triggering uh, error loop where and the error would crash the server and it would continuously try restarting the server so I took and replaced the quantum mine but I took this one face off to disable it just in case I didn't want anything happening while I was recording I may leave it off because I don't really need it right now. I'll set it back up when I need it. But now that we have the book, we've got other stuff that we have to make. Yep. I took and planted some chorus fruit over here because we need the purple blocks. Back, back in here in case I need it. But the first thing we need to do is we need to make an oculus. And then a description table. So let's get that taken care of first. Okay. At. At ARS. Why is it doing that? I see it's superseding it. I'm going to have to do this the hard way. Oculus. Where is the recipe for the Oculus? Here it is right here. Need three stone blocks, a piece of glass, two coal, and topaz. 
I don't believe I have any glass. I'd have to go back here to grab it. I believe that's the one one of the things I didn't grab. Actually, I should have everything in here. Yep, there we go. We have an Oculus. And we need to make the table. Let's go back. I know I grabbed some wood. So let's, what's the recipe for the table? Um, we need a lectern and a table. Spell parchments, so two sticks and paper. Okay, let's grab a bunch of stuff. Sticks, paper, don't need that many sticks. And half the wood. I believe we also need a book. Okay. First, let's do the table. We need some parchment. Torch. I believe I have torches. Yep, I have a torch, so we don't need to worry about that. Feather. I forgot the feathers. got feathers somewhere. I think it might be in my mob system. I feel so disorganized. I apologize for this. I got plenty of feathers. I think I gotta clean this out again. Uh, I took and consolidated all my um, cyberware stuff. I don't plan on using it, but I needed to make a room for it. We'll check this out some other time. But I added that room to the complex. I apologize for all the running around, but let's get our table. Table feather, and we need planks and stuff. table goes in the lectern yeah, we got the table and the lectern let me put extra stuff in need some blocks I want to set this over here for now the table here and we have to take and put a written book in here we'll check that out later 
First, we got to look in our book for the first spell. Inscription table. Place the book in the inscription table. Three sections on the inscription table. got to create shape groups. You got to do all that. Then you got to go to the crafting altar. So we should probably create the crafting hour, altar in the blank room. Okay, there's the structures. Crafting altar. Here's the structure. Crafting altar. Each of the, as it says, depending on what you make your crafting altar out of, oops, it gateways are quite efficient, short range. Understand that. I was on the. Okay. As, as it says in here, I'll let you guys really read it for yourself. But you, you have to create the altar, and depending on what you make, make it out of, it gives different um, effects and. For example, wood planks with glass caps would have a maximum effect of two, and stone bricks with redstone caps would have a maximum of four effects per spell. Main blocks and the caps total of five in the structure. So by making out of the uh, making out of purple blocks with uh, sunstone block caps will gain you the most and it has to be made in this alt in this shape and out of different materials I'm gonna make it out of oh, I need a lever just waiting for it to get to the purple but I'll, I'm gonna make make this structure Actually, that doesn't look that bad. Quartz. What's the quartz? I hit the wrong one. I apologize. Quartz is a three. Quartz look nice, but I want to go for the maximum. But, yeah, make a five by five with your with your block in the middle which is going to be the sunstone and the next layer will be these well let's do it as we go um, let me grab the correct materials per per about about here of these okay that's the first one second layer let's check the book again to make sure we get this right three high and then the capstones and we got to get the magic walls 
Magic walls is just stone. I've got them already right here. But the magic wall. Solution block. Can't see it in here. Second. Magic wall, here it is. It's just a stone block with Ventium dust on either side. It makes 16, so they're really cheap. So the magic wall is three blocks high in the middle. Three either side. Check the book. Three either side. Then you put the the other four capstones on top of that. One, two, three and four. Yeah, I make some steps. Probably need more than that, but we can make more. Back to the book. I love it when they do these building instructions. You gotta put the lectern on, we're gonna do that afterwards. That layer. Okay, we gotta make four internal on the layer three. One, two, three, and four. And the top layer has to be okay. I see how that works. One, two, tuck one in there. Four. I need four more. Two of those here, this one here, one in the middle, and the last one here. And we have one more thing to make. Uh, actually, two. I don't need these anymore. Let's put these in here. Um, need a stick. And a piece of stone. Cobblestone. I think I've got some over here. Or a lever if there's one in here. I think we just go with the uh, cobblestone. Okay, we need to make a lever. We're going to take and put the lectern right here. Don't know what it does, but it's sitting there. <coughs> <coughs> Sorry. You got one more thing to make. And that's this crafting altar, which is a vidium dust and a chiseled stone. Of which the stone brick works. And the dust. Oh, look 
looks like I'm gonna have to use it use my chisel to make it chiseled. See if this works now. Here we go. Put that up here and the structure is complete. What we do with it, we'll figure it out. But when you look in here, This is the different tabs. Okay, let's look at the book. First spell, not Oculus. We've got the inscription table. We've got the crafting altar. We need a blank rune. Which will, sounds like we gotta check on that later. Three sections in the inscription table there are no the source region is a large gray square at the top. It will contain all your known shapes, component Oh there's an inscription table. Oculus. Three blue skill points to make this possible. Craft a writable book, head over to the inscription table. Create shape groups by dragging shapes and or force models from source region to any of the shape groups. Okay, this is still with the table. Let's look at the interface of the table. Yep. You have the shape groups down here. Okay, first of all, let's look in here. Projectile. That's one. We got gravity physical damage. Let's go with physical damage. Magical damage or fire damage. Let's try magical damage. So we've got this set up. Go in here. Yep, we got the projectile, magic damage, and physical damage. Let's call it magic. Well, just reference the old D and D game. to drag stuff to make shape groups okay region is the top gray square contain all your known shapes components modifiers shape group selected is identified by brown squares there are multiple brown squares multiple shape groups can be created finally there is a spell grammar section which is the gray rectile at the bottom Create shape groups by dragging shapes and or modifiers from the source region to any of the shape groups in the UI. You can create multiple shape groups in the same spell, three by default. Each shape group can have up to four shape modifiers. Shape groups cannot contain components. A good way to think about is that shape groups are different meanings of target things within the spell. Then the spell grammar is what the spell actually does. Once your shape groups are created, Drag the spell parts you want in order from the source region of the spell grammar section. Spell grammar section can contain spell shapes, components, and modifiers in addition to the shape groups. Once your combination is crafted, go to your crafting altar and place your book containing the spell on the lectern. 
Throw a blank rune into the middle of the crafting altar and begin the process and follow the book's prompts. The book itself is worth reading as well as it contains a recap of what the spell recipe is for the materials listed for the spell and the affinity breakdown of the spell. Note that certain crafting altars can only craft spells that are, only, that are so powerful. Too much power and bad things can happen. See the entry on crafting altar for more info. Okay. See if we can figure this out. Okay, we got this. I want to see what this says. What's invalid book tag? So I guess it's not done yet. the projectile uh, that might help Let's see what it says now combination physical and magical damage and you, well, that's a lot of stuff So what we got to do now is gra gather all the stuff that's listed here. And we would have to take them and add them to the altar. Blank rune, Vintium dust, arrow, snowball, Fropa rune. Purple rune, lapis lazuli, a book, stone sword, a red rune, iron sword, and a spell parchment. Spell parchment parchment is placed last. I'm gonna gather these items, and then we'll we'll finish this next episode because we're pushing uh, 30 minutes. But until then, I'm going to place the book in here. Don't know what that does yet. But I'm going to locate the items. And next time, we shall experiment with creating our first spell. Thank you very much. Uh, we'll continue this in uh, another day or two. I'm going to see you next time. Be sure to put your comments down below and hit the likes. Thank you very much. To be continued.